Warriors Championship Consolation, sponsored by the Ohio Harness Horsemen's Association. At one mile, the purse $5,250. Field of seven, no changes. Perfecta and a trifecta wagering. Here's the field, the one Rose runs are. Well, by Herb Colburn of Clarksburg, Ohio. Keith Haynes driving. To Tickle My Elmo, owned by Bethany Schmidt of Beach City, Charlie Myrica. Three, CSI Ricochet, owned by the CSA Farms of Hickory, North Carolina. Driven by Joe Essig. Four is Up and Over, owned by the Thistle Stable, Ron Stack, and uh, Robert Smoko of Ohio, Ron Stack Drives. Five, Buckeye Begonia, owned by Sherald and Marion Haynes of Blissfield, Michigan. Cheryl Haynes drives. Six is Valboy, owned by Willard Miller of Jamestown, Ohio. Mr. Miller driving. And the seven, Mr. Whipple, owned by uh, Jeff Richardson of Columbus, Ohio. Dick Richardson, Jr. is in the sulky. Two-year-old trotting Colts and Gildings are all in behind the gate. The gate swings into the stretch for the start. Here they come. They're off into trotting Buckeye Begonia, stepping out promptly for the lead. Up and over alongside is right there in second, Rose Run Czar, cutting the corner on the inside. And coming away in fourth, CSI Ricochet. Inside trotting five, Valboy racing sixth on the inside as they move to the backstretch. Tickle My Elmo, the trailer, Mr. Whipple. Off the turn, going to the quarter, and on the outside, taking the lead now. It's Buckeye Begonia. Buckeye Begonia, clearing Rose Runzar, will now settle in on top as they trot the quarter in 29 and 4. Two year old trotting Colts and Gellings move to the far turn, and on the front, it's Buckeye Begonia. Rose Runzar gets the pocket seat here. CSI Ricochet on the inside, trots in third. Val Boy waiting for cover in fourth. Inside in five, up and over. At the rail and trotting in six as they come past the stands. Tickle my Elmo, Mr. Whipple, trailing the field. Coming to the half, and it's Buckeye Begonia with the lead. Here comes Essek with CSI Ricochet to the outside. Rose Runzar now in the pocket, trotting in third. Then a gap of three lengths, fourth to Val Boy. Halftime at 101, four fifths as they swing to the back stretch. Buckeye Begonia coming in from Montpelier, leads a length. At his wheel in second, as they swing to the backstretch, it's CSI Ricochet with Rose Run Czar directly behind the leader third. Three lengths in fourth to Valboy, underway from fifth. Here comes Tickle My Elmo, inside and sixth, up and over. The trailer, Mr. Whipple, trotting three quarters in 132-1. And it's still Buckeye Begonia, and CSI Ricochet will not go away. Relentless on the outside, trotting in second. Tickle My Elmo advancing third, and here comes Mr. Whipple, charging up on the outside for it. Top of the stretch with less than a sixteenth to go. Buckeye Begonia has led every step of the way. CSI Ricochet on the inside will now battle for the second spot as Mr. Whipple is coming strong. It's Buckeye Begonia. Buckeye Begonia will win it by two. CSI Ricochet finishing second. Mr. Whipple was third. Stepping trackside to the winner's circle, winning his fifth of nine career starts, a very impressive two-year-old colt, Buckeye Begonia. Buckeye Begonia, a colt by striking Sabra from the great Christus crown mare, Miss La Mirage. A homebred is owned by Cheryl and uh, Marion Haynes of Blissfield, Michigan. Cheryl Haynes, the trainer and the driver. Buckeye Begonia in from Montpelier with his second consecutive win, shotting the mile in record time, 205 3 fifths. Caretaker for the two-year-old youngster, Jason Haynes. The third race, sponsored by the Ohio Breeders' Championship Consolation. And a track side to make the trophy presentation, Joe Asher and his wife, Pat. Mr. Asher, past president of the OHHA and longtime legal counsel.
Official results, third race, number one, Rose Renzar, seven. Tickle My Elmo, four. CSI Ricochet, two. Up and over, five. Buckeye Begonia, the winner.